Farmers from several villages in Region 3 benefited from the government's flood relief grant, which was rolled out to assist farmers who suffered losses due to the nationwide flooding. The initiative was spearheaded by Minister of Agriculture Zulfikar Mustafa, who visited Viva La Force Primary, Potential Secondary and Wales Secondary Schools on Saturday. Minister Mustafa reiterated a number of promises delivered within the PPPC administration's first year in office. He said Region 3 will experience significant development. A lot of investment the government is making, and as I said, this area here, the West Bank of Demerara, will be an area that a lot of investment will be coming your way. A lot of job creation will happen here. A lot of opportunities will become available here. And this area here will be one of the areas that many persons will want to come to live. And rest assured, we will work continuously with each and every one of you to improve your life on a daily basis. The distribution saw scores of farmers turning out to uplift their grants. DPI spoke with several farmers who expressed their views on the program. I'm really thankful that this could put me right back. In fact, right away, I'd be going on Monday, change this check and start back buying back limestone, mold, fertilizer, seed, seed link, and be back on it again. We wanted to work with the government. We wanted to work with the government. We wanted to be in the government must be one. We must work together and build our country, build our community. And this is what I'm looking for. We must work. This was a very good initiative. We have all lost and at least we will get to put it back into continuing our farming and um, we have also received some other benefits after the flood and I I must say I'm very, very thankful on behalf of the entire association for this initiative. And it will help us to continue doing what we do. The government is doing very well. I'm thankful for the little morsel that they could make use of it. Farmers who suffered losses but have not yet received the grant were advised to provide their names to their Neighborhood Democratic Council or to a National Agricultural Research and Extension Institute officer.